Hello friends, welcome back and in this video tutorial we will see how to download and use Cisco Packet Tracer in Windows 11 PC. In this today video tutorial, first we will learn how to download and use Cisco Packet Tracer. We will discuss the basics of Cisco Packet Tracer and after that we will establish an peer-to-peer -peer network by using Cisco Packet Tracer. But first we will see what is the Cisco Packet Tracer. Before going into the Cisco Packet Tracer, we will discuss what is Cisco. Cisco is a very popular software and hardware manufacturing company and they are the leader in networking. And Cisco Packet Tracer that also called CPT is an innovative and powerful networking simulation tool used for practice, discovery and troubleshooting. The best thing is for this tool is it help us to understand networks practically. Now we will see how to download the Cisco Packet Tracer in your Windows 11 PC. To download the CPT or Cisco Packet Tracer, we need to open any web browser in our Windows 11 PC. I will use Google Chrome here and then type netacad.com. Once you are done, just scroll a little bit down, you will see the packet tracer option here. Just click on this packet tracer option and it will take you on the next page where you can download the free Cisco packet tracer when you enroll in one of the three self paced packet tracer courses. You can see the details by clicking on view courses. It takes 5 to 10 seconds to open and it will automatically take you on Cisco packet tracer page. Here you have to scroll a little bit down and you found the option getting started with Cisco Packet Tracer. Click on it. And here you have option to download Cisco Packet Tracer in different languages. I choose English and then click on get started. And here you need to log in by your username and password. If you don't have then you can use your Google account also by clicking here or you can create new by clicking on this sign up option. I already have an account and I type my email and password here and click on login. After login, you can download Cisco Packet Tracer from here. I already enrolled the course so I click here on resume course. It automatically take you on next window and here you find option download Cisco Packet Tracer. Just click on this link, it will open a new window and by scrolling little bit down, here is the option to download Cisco Packet Tracer for Mac operating system, Linux operating system and for Windows operating system also. I click here on Cisco Packet Tracer for Windows option and download will start automatically. Like this, you can download the Cisco Packet Tracer free for Windows operating system. I already downloaded and installed. Let me open it and show the Cisco Packet Tracer. So Cisco Packet Tracer is being opened now. This is the workspace where we are going to build the network. And down here on left corner, we have so many tools. For example, if you click here, these are the routers. Cisco have a variety of routers. You can choose any of this router you want. And if you want switches, just click on this one. You will get a variety of switches and I always prefer and use Cisco 2960 switch. If you want hubs, just click here. You will get some hubs. If you want to use some wireless devices in your workspace, just click here. So many wireless devices like wireless controller, access point, wireless home router or cell phone towers are available. And if you want some cables, just click this. You will get some cables. Maximum time we use these two type of cables. This is the Ethernet straight through cable and Ethernet crossover cable. If you want end devices, just click here. You will get lot of end devices like desktop PC, laptop, server, printer, IP phone, 
television, tablet, smartphone, and many other end devices. And if you want security devices, just click on this. You will get security devices like firewall. We will explore and use many of these things in this and coming video tutorial. Now together we will make a simplest network as an example where we will just take two desktop computers and we will establish a peer-to-peer -peer network. For that I click on end devices option here and then I click on this that is a desktop computer and then click on workspace area. For second computer I click and hold and drag this PC on workspace area and release it. So like these two ways we can choose our end devices in Cisco Packet Tracer. So now we have two computers in our workspace area. Now question is what type of cable is used in order to connect these two computers. I hope so you know that for connecting two different type of devices we have to use Ethernet straight through cable. And for connecting two devices of same kind we have to use crossover cable. Since these two are same type of devices so we have to use Ethernet crossover cable. How to use crossover cable in Cisco Packet Tracer? Just go to the cable part that is connection part and we have to click on this crossover cable and then come on this PC. Just click on this PC and here you found four ports. First is R232 port which is serial port and then two USB ports and one is fast ethernet port. We are going to connect on fast ethernet port. Just click on this and again go to second PC and click on this second PC and click on fast ethernet port. So now we have two desktop PC that are interconnect with crossover ethernet cable. So physical connectivity is done and now it's time to logical connectivity. For that we need to assign any IP address to these both PCs. To assign IP address click on this computer. Go to the desktop option. In desktop option you will find IP configuration. Click on it. And here we will give some IP address to this PC. Let it be 20.20.20.1. And let us not care about this subnet mask and gateway right now. We just configure and focus on IP address. So I assign the 20.20.20.1 20 20 20 IP address to this PC and close it. And to second desktop PC, I assign 20.20.20.2 by following same steps. I click on second desktop PC, then go to desktop option, then go to IP configuration and give 20.20.20.2 and that's it. So now we have assigned the IP address to our both PCs. Now I will put a label so that it will be easy for us to understand. This is just a label and this PC IP is 20.20.20.1 and other one is 20.20.20.2. Now we will see whether these two computers are reachable or not. To check that I will go to command prompt of this PC in Cisco Packet Tracer and try to ping the second PC that is 20.20.20.2. .20 For that I click on desktop PC then go to command prompt and type ping 20.20.20.2 .20 and now need to press enter. After pressing enter this PC will send 4 packets and if the connection is there it will receive the 4 acknowledgements. I will press enter now. Yes, I get a reply for the four packets that are sent. So this is the first and very basic video tutorial regarding Cisco Packet Tracer. I hope so. Now you know that what is Cisco Packet Tracer and how to download 
and how to use Cisco Packet Tracer. In this video tutorial, we create a very simple peer-to-peer -peer network between two desktop PC without any switch. In next video tutorial, we will create a simple and basic network with the help of Cisco switch. Thank you for watching and please don't forget to like, share and subscribe my channel. Thank you.